get this in public? I need to check this out somewhere where no one can see. Why can't I just tell her I have a girlfriend? <sighs> I know this is sudden, but here's some trivia for you, as you seem to have finished class. Did you know the United States outlawed alcohol between 1920 and 1933? It is said that this very prohibition paved a way for the cocktail culture to bloom. Alcohol made in secret tended to taste terrible. So people began mixing it with anything and everything to make it more enjoyable. These are the roots of the modern cocktail. The more you stamp on a weed, the more it thrives. My, that's deep. And that was the cocktail trivia for tonight. Empty already? Yo, Erica, I got an order. All right, you know what you want? Give me a rum and cola. Okay. I'll be right back. There you go. It's pretty rare for you to be here by yourself. Maybe I'll have a drink with you. Hey, don't you work here? Do your job. Ugh. With the boss like that? I thought an old guy like him would be cool, but boy, was I wrong. You sure know how to choose a place to work. Would you like to speak to Lindsay? Would you like to speak to Martha? Would you rather watch golf at home? Would you rather watch baseball at home? This one? I don't think Mr. Todd would say that. I hear Mr. Todd's body is heavily scarred. I hear Mr. Todd was hit by an axe. He doesn't want to show those scars to his wife. I hear Mr. Archie has many new rooms. He gets new ones every time he sleeps with a woman. I don't think he can forgive himself. <sighs> it's four days until the time of freedom. What are you talking about? Huh? You're gonna bother a cop on his break? You wanna ask me about that incident? I'm not gonna be much help. But it's men around your age who are dying. So be really careful. You don't seem too interested. Eh, no evidence has come up yet, and I'm on another case. Gotcha. I'm Morgan. If I find anything out about this incident, I'll tell you. So don't worry about the strange rumors. Well, I don't really care about the rumors. You got mail. Space? They lowered the application fee. It's cheaper now. Yeah, it's cheaper. It's only 50000 instead of 80000 What a steal. Besides, that's just the application fee. Who knows how much more the trip will cost? And what's this about marriage? You're joking, right? Uh, hmm. Trip into space, huh? Hello. Oh, hey. Do you have some time to talk? Your friend looks melancholic. You mean me? Sorry, but I don't have any problems for you to talk about, boss. Is the rest of your group working tonight? Some days our schedules don't meet up. That's all. It's a bit lonely without them. Speaking of which, the biggest reason men start thinking about marriage is loneliness. Marriage is a state where two people can't stand living together and can't stand living apart to nab a quotation from a certain someone. If you stay in an apartment by yourself long enough, you tend to start thinking, maybe if I had a family. But when it comes down to actually getting married, we 
all hesitate. Well, it makes me embarrassed to hear that. Throw back some liquor and hit the hay. To get the whole of the sky on the ground, you have to lie. Though that rumor about strange nightmares does worry me a bit. Strange nightmares? Why don't you ask around? Everyone here seems to be talking about it. You got mail. Ooh. 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 I don't want to let her down. Just... Ah. Anyway, I can't turn back now. I can't let her find out. Empty <sighs> already? Are you all right? I'm fine. Whiskey. Coming right up. Oof. Owen. I started to think about our high school days after what happened to Paul. Oh boy, Paul loved the girls back then, too. You and Orlando were always doing stupid things. Didn't you guys once eat Catherine's lunch and get chewed out for it? Did we? I know she was mad, but she started bringing you snacks once in a while. Remember? I thought she just wasn't hungry. Eh, dumbass. There was so much going on back then. We were all busy with our own problems. It wasn't all fun, but I felt more alive. More than I do now. It's with you all of a sudden. Is something bothering you? No. <sighs> hey, really, what's, what's going on? I'm just reminiscing. I'm gonna have another drink. If you're going home, be careful. Sure. You got me. I'll be waiting for you at the quadrangle. You'll be frozen with fear. It's a voice. Huh?
please, one more time. Woo! <laughs> 